Hello? Hi, how you doing? Hi, I'm good. How are you doing? Uh, I'm pretty good. So, is that your first time receiving a tarot reading? Um, yeah, I think so. I visited a psychic before with a certain kind of reading, but never specifically tarot reading, I don't think. N never specifically tarot reading. All right, so um, let me brief you a little bit of how it works. All right. So I've got like um, a few decks. I've got the main one, which is the tarot deck. It's the light series deck. I kind of use it for you to ask me um, just any question you wish to ask like it could mm -hmm. be about anything like love maybe career maybe like a certain situation that happened oh. um and yeah and to support it i've got um oracle decks and oracle decks are for like messages for oh. you like advice yeah cool. <laughs> yeah so do you have any question I in your do, mind actually yeah, I have a, a question about like a situation that happened to me recently. I think I've been cursed, like legitimately. I oh, think I have shit. a curse. Okay. I went to the Luxor um, Hotel in Las Vegas and ever since then, ever since I got back, just weird stuff has been happening to me. I feel very unlucky. I just feel like negativity in my life. Like I feel kind of downtrodden. I see. Okay, let me take a look into that. Um, okay and yeah i'm so, i'm 100 percent serious by the way like not even joking around i i believe that i am actually cursed and i'm worried like legitimately worried about myself i see we'll take a look into that and we'll see what we can also like do about it like i can give you advice on how to like clear curses um really i sound i sound crazy <laughs> no 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 you, but yeah, you're not crazy bro like I'm clearing joking. the curse is exactly what i need like that would be awesome actually thank I'll, you i'll give you advice like there's something that i personally use but like after the tear reading i'll i'll like give you advice on how to like cleanse anything like really bad curses or whatsoever if you ever feel down um hmm. so let me like start with the reading and see like if like you really are cursed if the energy is bad or mm -hmm. if it's really from the place that you went to oh, um okay. right yeah now let's start um may i have your name uh, natasha, my name right? is yeah natasha natasha okay yeah. nice to meet you natasha let's nice start to meet the reading you. and your name is so, webster webster or you can call me emmy okay emmy. both work oh that's a nice name <laughs> yeah. thank you i appreciate it <laughs> All right. Um, so, all right, guys, tell me more about Natasha's curse. Did she really get cursed when she went to the hotel? God, I'm nervous. Okay, don't be nervous. You're good. Okay, okay. Have the three of cups reverse. Clarify the three of cups reverse. Uh, okay. I got the tower. I got the wheel of fortune reverse. See, um. I got like the number 10, the Wheel of Fortune has oh. number 10. Did you travel in October? Yes, by any chance? I did. Awesome, awesome. Yes. Awesome. Um, you were not alone? Were, were there like two or three people with you? Yes, I went with my boyfriend okay. and a few other friends. Very good. Uh, I got the tower. The tower usually represents like, um, ca like chaos. <laughs> so I do feel like negative energy in the cards. Oh. It's all reversed. Oh to my be God. honest really yeah no way yeah like i do feel like negative energy but like i don't know i know it's like weird for me to say uh maybe it couldn't be true but i feel like a lot of things around you were bad except like your boyfriend with your mm. boyfriend like that was stable that was fine but it's just everything else around you mm. it just happened and it all happened simultaneously am i right yes like, you're, you're exactly time. right a All ton right. of like weird um, stuff happened we got covid actually you got covid yeah. oh my god yeah but good thing is that i don't know like it never affected like your relationship with your boyfriend mm. that's like a really good thing like it couldn't so what it's telling me is that your love is so strong <gasps> that not even a curse oh, can, really? can affect it yeah that's actually true like even though we've been cursed like we've been great bro we've been having like the time of our lives lately that's really, really good. Like, I'm honestly happy for you. Like, really, really good. And keep this up. Whatever energy you guys have going, keep it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, alrighty. Now, let's see if we have, like, any advice for you. 
Okay, I'll take any advice that you have... got. <laughs> awesome. Do you have any advice for her? Right, hold your vision, verify. Don't let your past hold you back. Right. Um, so, three different, like... I got three different things. I got, it's time to take action. It's a new moon in Aries. Um, I got hold your vision. I got don't let your past hold you back. This is what? kind of out of context, but whatever it is that happened in your past, um, it's associated to the curse. You know, I feel <gasps> like it's it's really out of context. I don't know, like you might think it's because of the hotel, but to me, I feel like it's not because of it. I just feel really? like it's because you at the moment, like, see, I got hold your vision. So that means you achieved a lot of things in your life more than your friends in the past have achieved so i feel like because of jealousy Ooh. they that brought up too much energy to a point where they manifested the worst for you wait i but, have a friend named tectone and i i feel like he is definitely jealous of like everything that i've achieved he actually tried to kill me in world of warcraft and that might have been shit. a manifestation of that shit I see, but I just feel like there's a lot of jealousy because honestly, what I see is like you really, really achieved a lot more than like any of your friends. Like, I'm not even joking, like any of your friends have achieved. Um, that is one, and let's Whoa. try to like get more messages. Bro. Okay. Is it looking like good or bad? It's not like, see, it's not terrible. The good thing is that it's not terrible. Yeah, like I'll take you that. yourself, you have you have really good uh, energy within yourself. I feel like you're you're true. Like you are yourself. You know, like oh. you're just true to yourself and to people around you as well. Um. So, right. So how do like clear a a curse? Oh. Um. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Clear it. So first thing that i actually do i get like um i get like an egg an right egg um just an egg literally that's it just, just one an egg. egg just one egg right mm. um i put an egg like in a jar right any um, kind of jar like does it need to be a any mason kind jar? Of jar okay any okay. kind of jar just make sure it's like a clear jar Okay. Um, and you can see through it, right? Okay. So you pour water in the jar and then you put an egg in the jar. Oh. Um, if the color of the egg, do you know how sometimes like you see like red dots in the eggs? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so if you see that one in the jar, that means that indicates like curse, you know? Really? Um, yeah, so I want you to you know have intention within you mm. i want you to like put in um pink himalayan salt okay. right um and i want you to put in like uh rose petals in it oh, and could i, get I rose want you to petals? put in <laughs> yeah anywhere it just any rose petals okay. um right and i want you to put in garlic and mm. i want you to like completely seal it and yeah. like leave it Sorry, I'm taking you notes. Just, it's alright, you're cool. Leave it for some time and make sure, like, the most important thing while you're doing all of that is, like, you need mm. to have really... You need to have intention that you're okay. letting it go, right? Mm. Um, and then after that, um, you light up a candle, right? Okay. Make sure the candle is not scented. Non-scented candle? Okay. Non-scented candle, right? Okay. You keep it on, right? And okay. then... Um, after right while it's on deep down you're gonna feel that the curse is gone you're gonna you're just gonna feel it you know mm -hmm. what you're doing you're you're kind of like with with what we added in the jar it's kind of like to cleanse the the curse itself oh. right so uh, once you feel like within yourself that right you feel like it is cleansed i want you to take the jar mm -hmm. i want you to open the lid i want you to like flush it down a toilet Right? Is that safe? Um, like, can it? It's toilet? very safe. Okay, okay, okay. Don't worry. Yeah, it's it's just. Yeah, like... I put bigger things in the toilet. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh my god! Right. So like, flush it down. Uh, close the toilet lid. 
flush it completely and let that curse go away and flush them and then okay yes and then go back to that candle that was lit and you know light it off just and like you're good. blow it off like whoosh. blow it off okay yep. exactly okay. blow candle <gasps> Okay, one more question. Does the egg need to be yeah. within its shell or should I crack it? No, you gotta like crack it. Okay, crack the egg. Okay. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I mean, I, I think I could do it. I think I could do it, right? Yeah, and honestly, it's not only for like curses. Um, I also use this if like I feel like I'm having a really bad time or day, you know, or like I feel like Mm. I brought in someone in my life that does not have the best energy yeah, or the best attention towards me. Yeah. yeah, it really, it really is useful. Like a lot of people do different things, but I feel like this is the most effective one, to be honest. Mm. Okay. Yeah. Alrighty. Alright. Um, that was I actually really good advice. Like I'm not Thanks. even gonna lie. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Um, I feel more right, at love peace. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm really glad that you feel more at peace and. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the reading. And I did. Thank I hope you. you have. Alrighty. Have, have a, a wonderful day. day. Bye, Emmy. You too. Bye bye. bye.